Hey everybody, this is Jim from Top Jimmy Profiles. Today we're going to demo the Top Jimmy Bana Twin Profile Pack for the Kemper Profiling Amplifier. Let's make some noise. All the profiles in this pack were made using the Fender Joe Bonamassa 59 high powered twin amplifier. So this is his signature model. It's based off of, I believe it's his favorite 59 original twin uh, that he bought from the actor Steven Seagal. Uh, I believe that one is all stock except for the speakers. The Jensen's were swapped out for uh, Celestians. I believe it has 80 watt Celestians in it. Uh, this one is the same thing. The circuitry is all modeled after a stock 59 twin, but the speakers are Celestian JB85s, which are 85 watt Celestians made especially for this amplifier. Uh, this is a high quality build. It's built like a tank. The shipping container is, I think, 85 pounds. Um, <laughs> high quality components throughout Mercury Magnetics transformers, high quality capacitors. Uh, sounds amazing. Uh, I like it so much, I'm going to keep it. So the amp looks pretty much stock. Uh, the, the tweed isn't shiny like a new amp. It's been slightly weathered. Um, so you can see a little bit of glue stain there and a little bit of weathering there, but very slightly weathered. Uh, otherwise, let's see. This is serial number 0042. They only made a, did a run of 300 of these initially. So I placed an order the first day. Got a low serial number. Uh, the only real difference, like we said, is the speakers. This is the Celestian Bonamassa speaker. So we profiled with this one as well as a vintage 1970 greenback, 25 watt greenback. <laughs> One of my favorite things that came with the amp was this card here that shows Joe's settings for Strat and Les Paul. Um, so of course we profiled, made some profiles using those settings. Um, we also made some profiles using his overdrive, which is a way huge overrated special. He actually uses the side-by-side -side version of this, but this is a single channel version. Uh, 
sounds the same. Uh, I also squinted at a rig rundown of his and found the volume and drive settings that he uses. So we pro made some profiles with those as well. One thing that's really cool about this amp is that even though it's only a single channel, you can still get a wide variety of tones out of this by simply using your guitar's volume and tone knobs. Uh, what Joe does, Bonamassa, what he does is he sets the amp at about maybe eight and a half out of ten, and then he, for a clean channel, he just dials back the volume on his guitar, and it cleans up really nicely and it holds a nice tone. Uh, he used to have, I think, four amps on stage and a whole bunch of pedals. Now he uses just these and an overdrive pedal and a wah, and that's it. So as always, all the sounds you've heard here were generated by the Kemper. Uh, the signal changed is guitar, cable, Kemper, DAW. No external EQ, no external reverb or anything, all within the Kemper. No funny business. So the sounds you've heard here are what you'll receive if you buy the pack. Alright, thanks everybody. Please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you next time.